Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then welcome. My name is Debbie and this is my crafty Dan. So I'm going to do a plan with me in my social media planner for the week of November the 27th to December the 3rd. This is the last week that's in the November section of the Happy Planner. And I want to make this easy, quick, simple. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take my pages out and I'm just gonna try to make this a quick little spread. So I think that the easiest way to do this, I'm loving this wide washi from the washi tape shop. This one is called Dusty Blue and Cinnamon, and it is perfect coloring to do a spread for a social media planner. I'm going to try to find washi tapes in these browns, I think, to go with the cinnamon in here. So let's see. Oh, there it is. I couldn't find the end of this washi. So is that close? It could be a little more of a reddish brown, maybe. Do I have something like that? That's more of a golden brown color. This might be the closest color. Hmm. This one might have to do. So this one and a blue one. And I'm looking at this color right here and it's kind of a medium bluish with a gray tone to it. And it kind of goes with these blue flowers pretty well. So that's what I'm going to use. I'm going to start by putting the cinnamon color or the brown up here like this. Old Timmy's card so that I can get my nice straight edge. So I'm going to do something with my washies that a little bit different this week. I'm going to I'm going to put both of these in the top box. like this. And then I'm going to put the blue in this box. And there. I was wondering if I'd be able to get that <laughs> close enough to that brown so that it wouldn't look funny. That's all the narrow washi that I'm going to use. I'm going to use this washi here. And what do I have already cut out? Do I have some in here? I do have some in here already. Let's see what we have. I'm going to use my scissors. And I'm going to cut like this. I have that one. And this floral here. And I'm taking the long pieces, like these long ones, off and trying to go for these groups of flowers here to start with. So I'm going to cut them 
right in half right down the middle just like this because what I'm thinking because I want to fill this bottom in a lot with the florals so what I'm thinking Just going to cut some of that extra off. I'm going to take this and put it on here like that. I'm going to take the next one. I'm going to cut it right in half. Cut some of that excess background off of it. I like that. So I have it right on the edge of the tape. I'm going to do this long one the same way. I need a longer pair of scissors when I'm cutting that far. There. What is it, Lucy? What can I do for you? Oh, don't, don't scratch my chair, honey. I'm going to take this a long bit. Put it on this bottom line. I'm going to put this on the bottom line like that. So I thought rather than having my white space along the top or the bottom of this box, I'd kind of go from the top and the bottom and put the white space in the center. I just thought that would look a little better. There. That's really pretty. And I need some more for right here. So I need another flower set like that. So I'm going to take this one and cut it in half. And this way the florals go right to the top and the bottom edge of that box. So let me do my sidebar as well. I'm going to cut that like that. And like that. I'm going to go all the way down here as well.
I'm going to take this little piece right here. It's just a teeny tiny little bit that was cut off of something else. But I'm going to put that straight edge. Am I? No, I'm not going to leave that all there. I can't put that there. It's just I need to cut some of this off. Sometimes you just have to do a little sticker surgery. There. So I have this side edge now. I kind of love that. And I'm wondering if I need to do something like that down this side here as well. Maybe I can put them right down the outside. What I could do, a bunch of bits that are just these beautiful golden brown cinnamon colored branches and leaves and a few florals that are so pretty. There. So let's see what I can do down this page right here. I'm just going to take some of these and go if they go over the edge I'll just cut them off after And there, so I have all of my florals down and I just think they're so, so pretty. So I'm going to put some bullet points down here. So down here. And the only other thing that I'm going to put down on here is something coffee related, I think, just because of the colors. My goodness. I love that little sticker there that says coffee is why I got out of bed today. <laughs> so I think I'm just going to... There. Instead of cutting that whole roll off to get to this, I just kind of kiss cut that with that little tool. And I'm going to put this up here like that. Just a little something up in that corner. And I have some of these to-dos. And the reason that I don't use them a lot is because they've got these little colored asterisks on them. Come on. Gosh, I have such a hard time with the clear-cut stickers. So my little headers are just going to get the asterisks cut off.
there. So I have my little to-do headers there. And I think that's done. I'm just going to put it back on my discs and see how it looks. I've got these kind of champagne colored discs. So I'm thinking this should look nice on here. And it goes nice with those discs. So there it is. That's the whole complete spread. I hope you like it. I do. I think it looks lovely. It's functional. Everything that I need is in these two uh, rows here. And then the third row in these columns is I just decorate. Absolutely. So it's so, so pretty. I hope you like it as much as I do. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Let YouTube know that you're watching. And let me know also in the comments, where are you watching from? I'd love to know. I'd love to hear from everybody. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, I would really appreciate it if you would do that now before you left. Uh, according to the YouTube stats, 90% of the people that watch my videos are not subscribed to my channel. So I really appreciate you viewing, but if you could hit that subscribe button as well, that would be absolutely awesome. And I'll see everybody in the next video. Until then, take care everybody and bye-bye for now.